Hello there, this is Telma, and it's going to be my playthrough of Corpse Party D2 Depths of Despair. I was kind of putting off on playing this, but I've heard a lot of good things about it. Then again, I also heard a lot of good things about Ao Oni and Yume Nikki, and then when I played them, they were not very good. So this game takes place after ending D2 of the original Corpse Party, or Corpse Party Rebuilt, it's the same game. And that game was kind of poopy too, so... Uh. But D2... Uh... Satoshi, Yuka, and none. Yuka dies. Satoshi, Ayumi, and Naomi make it out. Yoshiki and Yuka are dead, and Ayumi tries to get Satoshi to help her revive them using a magic tome, which is pretty much what Book of Shadows is based off of. Now I've kind of wasted a lot of time talking here. Oh yeah, and if the video quality is a bit worse than usual, that's because I can't use Fraps to record this game, because I can't use Fraps to record any Corpse Party fan game. Let's start her up. I hope the audio is right. Prologue. It was a rainy after school night. Just hours before, there were five of us preparing for the upcoming school culture festival. But now, two of our friends are dead. What's wrong? Mushida, are you sad? Shinozaki, what's wrong with you? Get a hold of yourself. Mushida, how do you think it feels when you kill someone? What? Do you think it's wrong to kill someone no matter what the reason? How about this then? Do you think it's wrong to revive someone? Oh yeah, and they use the same music from directly from the games. Like, I'm not going to take points away for that. It's hard to make music, but yeah. Revive? That's right, with black magic. Look, we can use this book. Are you are you high? What? Is that the is that the line? Are you high? Once a person is dead, that's it. They can never live again. You're wrong. Black magic laughs in the face of death. There's been reports throughout history of people being revived. It's real. You really intend to do this. Anything is better than doing nothing. Are you saying you're fine with our friends being dead? Are you saying you're happy that Yoshiki, and Yuka, and Kishinama died? Never. I will never give up. I won't let them die. And so I convinced Satoshi to join me as I struggled against fate. Shinozaki, are you sure this will work? Of course I'm sure. We just need to follow this book's instructions perfectly. Yuka and Kishinama will never will have never died. How do you know this? This book isn't even written in Japanese. My sister translated enough of it for me to tell what it does. And these notes in the margins will help me pronounce the words correctly. It will work. You know, you, you tried this in another game I just recently finished, and you know how that went. It didn't, didn't go well, but you know what? Let's try it again. Hold on, what do you need that for? The spell calls for the blood of the sorcerer, so I need to prick myself with a knife and combine my blood with the other materials. This doesn't sound safe, Shinozaki. What if this spell needs more than just your blood? Are you really going to let, let Yuki go that easily? Don't be such a coward, Mojita. This isn't about what's safe or less. This is for our friends. Now I just need to chant this sh spell. Mojita, I need you to hold up the book so I can perform the arm gestures. I kind of wish that they used the... Uh, like th These chat porches are actually pretty nice. But I kind of wish that they used the uh, uniforms from the original, you know, course party rebuilt because, well... These aren't the ones that they wore in that game. Like this? Don't interrupt the inc incantation, alright? The punishment for breaking this spell is severe. What do you mean? I'm not sure. That part wasn't translated, but it won't matter. We have to succeed. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Shinozaki. Wait, I can still do this. Yep. Yeah. Just as I suspected. Pretty much the same thing is going to happen. Shinozaki, sob, casting the spell. No, we're so close, I can't stop now. Saw blades? No, no, I don't want to die. Shinozaki, you idiot. Again. Shinozaki, what's going on? I don't want to die, make it stop. Push her out of the circle. No, I've already lost too many friends today. Push her out of the... Yeah, oh, don't go into it! Gah. Shinozaki, are you alright? Get out of the circle! I, I think so. What's she doing? Yep. Yep. What? No. 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 I'm not screaming that. Mmph. Why is this happening to me? Because you're an idiot. Oh, look how cute Mayu is! It's been so long since I've been in this room. No. Oh. Suzumoto, I didn't expect you here. I thought you'd be too busy with work. I miss out on seeing my friends, not when there's a chance of seeing Shige, Shige Ni here. Oh, she looks really nice. Like, I, I like the hair, Bo. It's good to see you again, Suzumoto. Why don't you go say hi to Shin... 
Shigeni. I had a feeling I'd see you here. Oh, dang, Mori Shigei, give me some of that. I wasn't going to miss a chance of seeing you again, Shigeni. How's your acting career been? It's been slowly. I've been trying to give myself more presence on stage, but you still have been cast for a lead role, have you? That does it. You'll be the lead in my next show. Oh yeah, that's right. Even though this takes place in the Corpse Party Rebuilt universe, they added these characters in. Which is nice, I, I guess. But let's see how it pans out. That really isn't necessary. I insist I'll pay you double whatever you're making now. Sounds like a generous offer, Marishige. You should take it. I'll consider it. Ew! I hope you didn't start the party without me. What's with your hair? Shinohara. What happened to your... Yeah! Oh, I lost a bet with one of my co-workers, so I got to keep my hair this color for the rest of the month. Okay, that's not... I, I was really hoping that wasn't, like, your own doing. You don't sound too upset about that. I let them win. <laughs> so, did I miss anything? Not really, I just got here a few minutes ago. I've been so busy lately, I was worried I wouldn't be able to come. Did everyone forget today was our class reunion? Actually, Shinazaki came here. Now me. Hello, Seiko. It has been so long since I've seen that radiant face of yours. We went out for dinner together last week. Don't you know how long that feels for me, Naomi? Hehe. <laughs> Ew, no. Aw, oh, why? Why? Aw, oh, okay. Mm -hmm. Ew, could I, could I talk to you for a minute? Of course, just a moment. I'll be back in a minute, everyone. Don't forget to include Shinozaki. She's been looking a bit lonely. Shinozaki's here? Naomi, let's go say hi. Alright. God, they walk so slow. Hello, Shinosaki. Is that you, Shinohara? That's right. How have you two been? Been really busy with work lately. A lot of people are getting hurt this time of year. I actually had to move some vacation time to make it today. The life of a nurse is a thankless one, Shinosaki, which is why Naomi is lucky I'm around. I wouldn't call being a nurse a thankless job. What about you, Ayumi? Did you manage to land a job as an illustrator? Sort of. I was commissioned to draw the cover art for the next book by Noho Senoki and Kokibiki. Oh, you mean that creepy book series about haunted schools? I might have to read the next one now. Hmm. Is something wrong, Ayumi? It's nothing. I just feel uncomfortable in this room. Why? This is our junior year homeroom. Think of all the memories we made here. Some of those memories are happier than others. She's talking about Satoshi's and Kishima's uh, disappearance. Oh. Hey, Seiko. Seiko, why don't you go talk with Marishige and Suzumoto for a bit? I want to ask Ayumi something. Okay. Let me slowly walk over here. Oh, I'm kind of mad that Tsukasa's in this game. Like, why him? I can't even tell anyone what really happened. The news of the week after they died acted like they just disappeared and the Mochidas moved away before I could apologize. What, what would you say? Yeah, sorry, I was, I was doing this magic ritual and like... Yeah, there was an accident. Like, what are you going to say? I know it's hard, Ayumi. I haven't been able to get over it either. Not entirely. How do you keep going? I try to keep my mind off it by working extra hours. Sometimes I'll skip a day of sleep just in case I have a nightmare. Seiko helps too, but I can't bring myself to tell her why I'm always so down. I wish I could go back and fix things. If I acted differently, Kishinama and Mochida wouldn't have died. We should go talk to the others. Try to smile, okay? I'll try. Wow, it's later than I thought it was. The sun's already set. Oh, that's why it's so red. It'll be dark soon. If it's getting dark, maybe we should turn out the light and tell a few ghost stories. Yes, I got plenty of ghost stories that none of you will believe. Hmm. Aren't you going to join us, Shinazaki? Uh, you aren't scared, are you? No. I thought you liked telling ghost stories, Shinazaki. I used to, then I lost three friends in one night to a ghost story. One of them was because I'm an idiot. Hi, Mir, are you feeling alright? Maybe you should go to the bathroom first. Yeah, I'll be right back. I shouldn't have lied to them. This music isn't really fitting. They might get worried when I don't come back from the bathroom. But I can't tell another ghost story, not after what happened last time. Whoa. Okay. Hey! Huh? Why do I feel so dizzy? Continued in chapter- that was- oh, I thought we were already on chapter one. Oh. Okay. You know what? Maybe I should just leave it at that. No, that's too short. That's way too short. 
chapter one now. Heavenly host, first lo Oh. What happened? Wait. Heavenly host? Oh, this is the music that plays when you play as Seiko for a little bit, near the end of chapter one of the first game. No, not again. No, why? Why is this happening to me again? Alright, you have to calm down. No, I don't take care of Shinazaki. I'm a bit worried about her. I'm alone this time, aren't I? I'll just have to look for a way out. I survived this once. I can do it again, I hope. Alright, well, we walk slow, but... Oh, is there a sprint? Maybe there was a sprint in rebuild. I don't know what the controls are. Now, let's go in here. Now, this music sounds a bit different than the version used at Seiko's part. Is it? This part sounds the same, but the rest of it sounds a bit different. It didn't sound cool enough. This letter is written on bloodstained red stationery. The name Ayumi Shinozaki is printed on one side. Which part of the, the part of the message is on the other side? Probably never get to read this, but I feel like I have to write this down just in case I don't get the chance to tell you in person. Oh, okay. Uh, items. Oh, okay. Fuck it. A, gla a glass bucket sits in the corner. Is that glass? Who uses a glass bucket? Yeah. Do, 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 do. Okay, that part's the same. The clock appears to be broken with the arms twisted at odd angles. Unruly students will have their mouths sewn shut. Don't enter the science lab during dissections. Don't enter the science lab or you'll be the next anatomical model during dissections. Oh, that's good. This is classroom 5-A. The door is locked. I'd feel a lot better if there were a keyhole. Oh, hmm. This looks like a custodian's closet. Yeah. It's in the same place. It barely budges when you try to open out, but something important is behind there. Of course I'm not getting anywhere without the key. Alright, so this is the heavenly host. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. In this timeline, was the school they went to called Heavenly Host, or was it just some generic random school? Because in the first game, it was just like, random elementary school. But in this, it seems to be Heavenly Host, because I know this layout. I don't remember those. And this is the entranceway? Yeah, oh, that's great. Hello. I hardly feel anything when I see corpses now. I used to be so afraid of them. What has this place done to me? This is a rotting body of a young boy. He looks to be a senior high school student. Do, do. This is the rotting body of a young boy. He seems to be a junior or senior high school student. Is this a gym bag? The gym bag reveals a label on the back. Shinozaki. Eh. This couldn't be mine, could it? Examine the bag more closely. Let's put it back for right now. I'll leave it be for now. Rotting body of a young girl. She looks to be a senior high school. Okay, let's save. Nice, fast save. That's what I like to see. The blocker won't open. Blocker won't open. Locker one open, and locker one open. Okay, so let's look in this. Check out the uniform gym clothes inside the bag reveal. Kisaragi ID tags. These tags are faded, but these clothes look just like my uniform. I, <clears throat> I'd better keep them for now. A change of clothes might come in handy if they still fit. Acquired the gym bag. And let me guess. Door is rude in place. Yep. Why can I see through the windows if the door isn't real? To be spooky. God, it walks so... Oh, man, there's actually doors here. This is something that always bugged me about the layout of Heavenly Host, because, like, there was always these big, empty spots up there, but there was no rooms in any of them. Doors rude in place, if it were decoration, I should probably read... Oops. I should probably read this. No more girls allowed in the boys' locker room. We're still cleaning up the last... Oh, a locker room. That makes sense, because the pool was there. Don't forget to turn in your permission slips. They need to be re in blood after each use. Ah, yes, that does make sense. This door is locked... No post on the frame reads, Girls locker room, bring a spare uniform and your gym clothes. I have my gym bag with me. Maybe I need to prove I have the uniform. Let's do other stuff first. Some notes over here. Don't leave your gym bags in the lobby. Two students have broken their necks on them already. Whoever runs with scissors down the hall next will be the next autopsy model. Give her bathrooms. There's way too many notes. Be sure to rinse the blood off your hands when you're done. There's so many notes. Too many. Oops. Girls' bathroom. Bring your permission slip. There's no keyhole. How am I supposed to... We need a permission slip. 
Am I just blocked? Hmm. No, I guess I don't go up there. I assume the other one's also like that. Blocked? It's blocked, yes, okay, so. Alrighty, so let's go in. There is locked, blah blah blah. I have my gym bag with me, yes. Door clicks and opens slightly, it should be usable now. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm. Ah, now my sleeve's covered in blood. Sink is clogged with thick black hair and the faucet is rusted. It's doubtful this sink still works. What a pretty looking room. Some dusty towels and other supplies are stacked here. Lock it one open. Whoops. Lock it one open. This towel is dusty and looking closely there are some dark stains on the cloth. Metal bucket sits in the corner. Sink is clogged with thick black hair. Shower head is rusted and beyond repair and the pipe is bent at a large angle. It won't be making... It won't be working anytime soon. The skeleton is clutching a note in its hand. Why don't you wash the blood off your clothes, Shinozaki? Eh. No, it couldn't be talking about me. This was written long before I came here. Maybe there's another Shinozaki at Kisaragi. Maybe that's who owned this gem bag. Another slip of paper lies near the skull of the skeleton. and has the words bathroom permission written on it. Take slip. I might need this. Yet we do... Oh, okay. The music stopped. Panic for a second. Shower head is recipe on repair. Blah, blah, blah. Maybe I can clean this blood off my sleeve with the shower. Let's not do that. Maybe later. In we go. Water sprays from the shower head. I'm surprised it's still working. Nothing else seems to work in this place. Maybe I should grab a towel before I step in. Not just going. I'll find a towel after I clean this off. Blood? But it was water just a second ago. Eh. Why is it burning me? Is it Titan blood? <laughs> Are you clean yet, Ayumi? Gah. Oh, well, that was boring. Doo -doo 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 -doo. Is there going to be the slap? Well, the hand's already there. I was hoping for the slap sound effect. Alright, try again. Does that just reload from my last save? I don't know. Yes, okay. I wonder if it's any different if I take the towel. Let's check. Turn the valve. Look for a towel. Better find a towel first. Oh, there's a, there's a towel. Okay. It's a bit dusty. I suppose it's better than nothing. Why didn't you just take the pink one? Eh. Shower head is now spraying blood. Some of the metal in the shower is starting to melt away. What's going on here? I guess I'll just have to live with a bloody sleep. I wouldn't put my hand in there to turn it off. It was just melted metal, and you're like, no, I gotta turn that off. Alright, well, I think that's more than enough for the first video. This seems okay so far. Thank you for watching, and goodbye.